Hey, 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 what's going on, YouTube? Taka Tanaka Giants here with a mail day video for you guys. Um, I got one package that came in from a seller over here in Japan. And uh, if you take a look at the background, I have Mr. Snake. This year is actually the year of the snake. 2013 is the year of the snake. So happy, uh, happy 2013, happy year of the snake to all of you people out there. Um, last year was the year of the dragon, by the way. Um, but uh, yeah, he's going to be helping me out in this video. So uh, like I said, I did get one package that came in. I got this lot that I picked up. Um, the seller actually shipped kind of like in a PWE. Actually, it's more like a PW, no, PBE, plain brown envelope. Um, he shipped just like this without any real protection around the case or inside. So the cards moved around quite a bit, which is pretty disappointing considering that they're pretty nice cards. But um, yeah, you can't really complain over here in Japan. Uh, there's so few sellers here that um, you know it, you don't want really you don't you don't really want to get blacklisted. You don't want to get uh, booted or blocked by anybody because there are some pretty good deals over here to be found. But um, that aside, I did open up a bag of potato chips. Let me take a look. Uh, this is the Evangelion Potato Chips series brought to you by Calbi. It does come with one card. I did bust the card. I did this is my second attempt at the video, but um, if any of you guys have experienced this in the past, but if you film on your iPhone and uh, somebody calls you or sends you a message, it just cuts the video. So that really sucked, um, but I'm just going to go ahead and show you the card that I pulled out of the back. So you guys might recognize Calbi from the baseball cards series, but they also make these as well. So here's the card that I got. Um, I'm going to make sure I bring it up a little bit closer to the camera. Hopefully that focuses. Come on. And there we go. It's a nice full bleed card. This is actually probably from the uh, movie series. I'm not really familiar with the movie or the series, but um, just love the artwork. Card number S20, I guess. Story card number 20, 47 of 96. I'm not really sure what all that numbering is for, but it's just a scene information on the back. But uh, yeah, Evangelion. I don't know how many people actually follow the series. Maybe Wesker Griff, you might, you might follow the series, but pretty cool. Um, I do enjoy free stuff with my bag of potato chips. But uh, okay guys, so uh, on to the package that I got in. Take a look in the background. You see the first card up on top. I'm going to go ahead and just uh, take this out of the case. Now I've already opened it up and one of the cards in here is a card that I'm actually holding for another YouTuber I'll be sending out. This is one of the cards I've been waiting on. So I won't be showing that card. So I'll be but I will be showing the other three because they're all pretty nice. But starting off with a nice Legends baseball, uh, sorry, Legends hit uh, out of this year's Triple Threads, or not last year's, 2012 Triple Threads, uh, Eddie Murray, Steady Eddie out of 36. Really solid looking card, just love all that shine. Um, next card up, like this, is a really nice five star Anthony Rizzo Auto. This is the rainbow version out of 25 on cards. Really, really sick. Um, looking to uh, possibly sell these cards if you're interested, any of the cards that you see here. Um, not really looking to trade right now, looking mainly to sell. I've had quite a, unless I've traded with you before and I know you, but I've had quite a quite a few problems with uh, trading with people um, in the last month, I guess. People just um, not shipping. It's just kind of a pain. So, um, but anyways, sorry, that was just a little mini rant. But uh, this is a nice Anthony Rizzo uh, rainbow out of 25. And the next card is actually another five-star card, but I'm just going to hold off on that because I don't want to ruin the surprise for, for the uh, YouTuber. But uh, the last card is actually really, really nice. Um, definitely one of my favorite relic cards now favorite patch cards in my collection but this is out of this year's uh, 2012 prime cuts take a look slow roll it baltimore shortstop you guys might recognize oh they can't even see that sorry guys <laughs> there you go i don't think it's going to come up but it's actually a really nice dual patch number eight cal ripkin jr it's a really really sick car guys um very, very nice indeed. Take a look at the back. Upside down. There we go. It's actually numbered to 10. You can really see that or not. But a very, very, very solid card. So if you guys are interested in any of the cards you see here, these three cards, just uh, hit me up. I'll just fan them out like that. There's still one card in here that I'm holding off as a surprise, but um, I'm sure that YouTube would be very happy. But these are the cards. So uh, let me know what you guys think, guys. I hope you guys are going to enjoy your 2013. I hope you guys had a safe New Year's and all that jazz. Um, yeah, and I wish you all a nice and a productive 2013, I guess. But uh, that's it for now, guys. As always, thanks you for watching. Um, looking forward to making more videos this year as well. Talk to you later. Happy collecting. Bye-bye.